this is the 118-year-old book that my grandmother tossed over to me that was out of my, my mother tossed over to me that was out of my grandmother's estate. The page, the page that it's open to, there is one hat on each page. There are 25 hat sketches in the book. There are 22 pages of notes about hat making. And there are 12 pages of hat supply lists for putting the supplies in the trunk that she carried when she was on her hat making campaign in, in the state of Oklahoma. Um, there are other things in the book. There are probably another 10 or 15 pages of quotes. I went back and I traced down the original publication of most of these quotes. They were from Reader's Digest and from Life Magazine. Um, a typical example is a stitch in time saves nine. So there were many, many of these. I think this book was her, uh, one of her self-education tools. All of the quotes that she wrote down were about keeping your mind clean, being nice to your friends, not burning bridges behind you, uh, et cetera, just leading a clean and good Christian life. There were also um, three or four recipes. Most of them had lemon in them, so I think that she liked lemon. Uh, this was such an important book to me that it is on the cover of this book. So the background of the book here is a page out of this little diary. I copied all of the language out of this book, I transcribed it, and I drew pictures of all the hats. And I used this as in background information for starting to write the book. <laughs>